What's up, sharks? It is. Your fault is awesome here. Otherwise, no spike. Bring you a new Minecraft video. Today, I'm showing you how to make a Minecraft uh, door opening thing. Whatever you can refer to as. Um. So first, let me do an example. Um, I'm just gonna flip all these switches. And while I'm flipping these switches, well, the switch flipping is already done, so I'm just gonna save it for the end of the video. So after all of them are hit, then this will open. Uh, this one is just to verify it. Uh, um, so once you get them all, hit that one, and the door will be open. But if it's not activated, then it'll be closed. Okay, so um, this is a very complicated schematic. Uh, let me show you just how complicated. Comparing to uh, some other things people make, it's just it's just insane. Okay, so the first two are uh, connect to one AND gate. Well, how are you? Um, an AND an AND gate makes it so uh. Two switches have to be activated in order for uh, the gate to be activated as well. So uh, this will power off. Uh, thus, this will power on. This will power off. This will power off. This will power on this. Thus, these going off. And then these will go as well. These have to be here, or uh, or one being activated will work as well. So basically, the uh, so basically the redstone is just cooperating with each other. So next up, you it just happens with all of the uh, redstone tor with all of the uh, levers. A couple of them have to go underground because they aren't uh, far enough away from the other levers. Thus, uh, they have to separate from the end gates, like this right here. Um, well, like this. So it has to go underground so uh, it can get to the end gate without interfering with other redstone connections. Okay, so right here is where the uh, th right here is where the verify switch is. Now, you're going to need to stretch this all the way over there, or wherever your door is. Now, the reason why I have these here is so that the redstone pulse doesn't go out. The redstone pulse will go out after about 15 blocks. Um, so, putting a redstone torch beside a block will uh, switch the pulse, but will also uh, make it so that... It'll switch the pulse, but it'll also make it so that uh, the red zone pulse will still... It'll make it so that the redstone pulse will uh, still be activated. So as you can see here, it's fully activated while it was just about to be deactivated right about here. Um, kind of hard to explain, but once again, these are just so uh, you can... They're just so... I'm trying to say here. They're so that the redstone pulse doesn't go out to there. So this is this looks like it's deactivated, but it actually is activated as you can see from the particles emitting from it. Um now both of these are gonna have to be deactivated. This is deactivated from the verify switch over there. And this will get deactivated with all the other switches. Because it's just a whole other series of AND gates that you use from different switches. As you can see here, uh, the two from the back stretch around, uh, go to an AND gate gotten from the uh, ones in the middle uh, and in the front. So the ones from the normal switches and the one from the verify switch uh, both toggle these on, toggle these off, so that so that this pulse goes off, this pulse goes on and it activates the door. Now, this may have seemed very complicated to some people, but... 
Well, I really don't know how else to explain it. I was explaining it from the top of my head. I was trying the best I can. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was useful to you as well, hopefully entertaining to you because my channel is just entertaining. And also, my channel is uh, is mainly for fun. I didn't really get the best feedback a uh, person can get from the last one, but for now. Oh, by the way, these holes that you see here were all gotten when I was trying to kill some slimes. I'm not kidding. So, yeah, if you like this video, rate, comment, and or subscribe. You know what? Nah, I guess I can go a little more in depth. This is what I had to go through every single, like, minute I tried to, uh, be building this thing. I even made an enchantment table over there so I can uh, help myself with killing slimes. You know, whatever. Um, so yeah, that's really about it. Uh, and gates power other and gates, which uh, activates an and gate, which uh, is also activated with the verify switch. Uh, so, yeah, a lot of AND gates are used, but for now, but, well, um, I'm really excited to see what people can build with this. Like, they can make mazes with each of the switches being hidden throughout, and, like, the verify switch will be at the very end of the maze. Um, it's just really going to entertain me to see that. So, yeah. I think that was the first creeper that I killed in this, uh, on my channel. Okay, so now, if you like this video, rate, comment, and or subscribe. Um, link to my Twitter will be in the description below. That's about it. Completely ignore the slimes in the background, so I'm just gonna flap. Why am I doing this? Alright, that, uh, that redstone repeater that you were seeing throughout the video, um, it actually didn't need to be there. Um, it's kind of hard to explain why it was there. Like, but, yeah, just in case some of you were wondering. Now, I'll see you guys later.